apparently full body stiffness is not a good thing. So here I am, hospital. Happy Saturday. Yes. Uh, I woke up. I feel pretty good right now, but I don't want to jinx it. You know what I mean? You know. I know. You know. <laughs> But right now, I feel the best I felt in like a solid week. So that that's awesome. Uh, still a bit uh, stiff, but I think that's just because I might be sleeping wrong. I don't know. Life. But other than that, uh, today is a good day. Uh, weather is actually supposed to be warm, not hot, so that's going to be amazing as well. And I'm uh, looking forward to just uh, having a, a good day and just kind of taking it easy, doing some homework, and. Ugh. Excuse me, going from there. But other than that, it's a good day, so on to the day. So I talked with my pharmacist and apparently full body stiffness is not a good thing. So here I am, hospital. Uh, had a x-ray done. Uh, now I've had some medicine put in through my IV and just waiting on uh, labs to come back. It's hard to finger spell with this on my pinky. So just waiting and uh, go from there, but I'm here now. They think it's a possible adverse reaction to the antibiotic, so we're uh, in contact with the poem gods and everyone else to figure out where to go from here so at least uh at least i'm in the right spot so here we are uh, well i have been sprung from the er and i'm back home finally oh, i'm a little excited about that why it means i'm not in the hospital Yes. Um, yes, I've got my little hard of hearing bracelets. Why? I'm hard of hearing. Without hearing aids, I can't hear people talk very well, so, especially in a loud hospital. Um, aside from that, my diagnosis is serum sickness, and I'm about to explain that, but first, let me sit, because I'm like really stiff still and in pain, so uh, sitting is necessary. <sighs> okay, to explain, serum sickness is a result of a medicine that is a reaction to the medicine, but not an allergic reaction. Also in English, it's basically a body's reaction to the medicine saying, I've been on it too much, that I, uh, I'm having, in essence, flu-like symptoms to said medication and therefore am starting to reject said medication. Not necessarily an allergic reaction. However, serum sickness at this early stage is mild and not considered life-threatening, but if continued, can become life-threatening. I can never be simple. I always have to go hardcore. 
I love me. Cheers. So aside from that, um, basically every time I'm given, like every time I get an infection, it's either Leviquin or Augmentin, and it's been Augmentin quite a bit lately, which is a form of penicillin. It's amoxicillin with um, clavoxin. It's a different type of uh, antibiotic on top of it. And I've been on Augmentin a lot, so I think my body's finally like, girl, you need to stop the Augmentin. Uh, essentially, the symptoms will subside in the next couple of days or so, the doctor says. And I've been prescribed another antibiotic to help kick what's left of the infection, um, hopefully. There have been some changes noted in my lungs uh, in terms of uh, the progression of my disease, but nothing in terms of infection or anything acute at this time. Um, so, yeah. I definitely have pulmonary fibrosis, so hey, there's no doubt about that. And uh, <laughs> in case we were all wondering, definitely no doubt about that. And uh, yeah, so have that looking for me. And then I spent an hour in traffic trying to get home uh, because they're building a new bridge over the highway and uh, they made a four lane highway one lane so that sucked and my sugar dropped so McDonald's was a lifesaver and I've just pounded like an entire thing of large fries so my sugar is probably gonna skyrocket here shortly too and it's already midnight so yeah that's been my four minute update of hospital trips for Megan uh, thankfully I'm still holding strong on not being admitted for over a year now. Um, actually, I think I'm on a year and five months because April last year would have made, April this year made a full year. So April, year and four months. Oh, year and four months. Oh, I'm so excited. Uh, I'm trying to keep it going <laughs> without being admitted, but as the weather starts to change, uh, my lungs do not get happy but at right at this point with the weight loss and everything my lungs are kind of happy with me however like i said we've noted changes in my lungs on imaging so obviously changes are coming you know you can stay try and stay as healthy as possible but you know health will always change with you so on that note uh as living as positively as possible and trying not to uh, moves too much because I'm so stiff. I will say thank you all for watching. As always, have a good night and I will see you guys tomorrow.